Dive into the past with a book that's one of the world's greatest unsolved mysteries. For more than two years, Juan José García from Burgos in northern Spain has been studying the Voynich Manuscript. Thought to have been written some 600 years ago, its author is unknown and the writing remains undeciphered. The images spark the imagination, but no one's sure what they mean. There are theories that the book might have been written in a kind of encoded Latin, or that an alien wrote it while being held captive in a monastery, or that Leonardo da Vinci wrote it as a child. There are a lot of people in the world who are currently studying the Voynich manuscript. Scientists have determined that the manuscript dates from the 15th century. That's a period of time that has always especially fascinated Juan José García. He's always searching for rare historic books, as was the book dealer Wilfried Voynich, who discovered the manuscript in 1912 in the library of a Jesuit order in Italy. He was able to buy it, but not to decipher it. In many books written in the Middle Ages or the early Renaissance, there's the author's fear of running foul of the authorities. That's why the books are partially written in a secret code. That's why some people suspect that the Voynich manuscript must be as well. At the same time, it exhibits so many peculiarities that don't confirm that theory. Historical books are the specialty of the small Spanish publishing company Siloué. For two years, some 20 specialists have been working on a facsimile edition of the Voynich manuscript. The original is owned by Yale University in the United States. Juan José García, who is a philologist, hopes his copy will be as authentic as possible. Some of the holes were repaired with uh, thread and uh, cotton thread, and some of the holes were repaired with uh, parchment thread. This is very difficult to reproduce, but the repairs, some of them have uh, lost uh, the thread, and uh, the, small, the small holes are made in the same place as the book. Bizarre plants that never existed in nature painted on the finest parchment. Old handiwork like this is a real treasure. The publishing house wants to sell the facsimile edition for some 8,000 euros a piece. The print run is limited to 898, and 300 orders have already been placed. It's possibly a treatise about medicine, pharmacy, or maybe about chemistry, a treatise about astrology and astronomy. When you touch the original, it awakens so many emotions and questions. You want to know who touched it, who could have made something like this, how many people were involved in making it. The author of the manuscript appears to have taken the answers to those questions to his grave with him, possibly along with knowledge about the healing powers of plants or the synergy of the stars. Unless, of course, someone manages to crack the book's code. We think that with this facsimile, which is very close to the original, we can make a contribution towards this manuscript, perhaps one day being fully encrypted. Perhaps there are the secrets of a past age hidden in these pages, wherever they may have come from. Juan José García aims to have the facsimiles finished in November, when he will present them to the public for the first time. And that might just be the beginning of a new chapter in the story of the Voynich Manuscript.